Number three, streamlining diagnosis. Over the last decade, clinical imaging has become increasingly digitized, first with radiology, now a fully digital practice, and more recently, pathology, which is now beginning to embrace digital technologies. This evolution is paving the way for computer vision and other AI-based approaches, which are spurring some important changes in how diseases are detected and diagnosed. One area of change is clinical workflows. With AI, clinicians can prioritize patients' images for analysis, essentially move them to the top of the virtual stack, based on the likelihood of an abnormal and potentially life-threatening finding. For example, Researchers in California recently developed a deep learning-based algorithm that can distinguish normal chest X-ray images from abnormal ones. Rather than search for just one type of abnormality, the tool simultaneously scans for up to 14 different conditions, including pneumonia, pneumothorax, enlarged heart, and lung nodules. It performed as well as radiologists in diagnosing a majority of these conditions and could analyze images in a fraction of the time. Incorporating such a tool into radiologist workflows could enable them to read patients' images more quickly and efficiently. Similar AI-based tools are also under development in pathology. These tools could help prioritize or screen patient cases according to the presence of cancer cells or other urgent findings, clarify borderline diagnoses, and integrate pathology findings with other clinical and laboratory data including vast molecular data to support the diagnostic, prognostic, and treatment decisions that clinicians make while caring for patients. These and other innovative image-based tools are ushering in a new era of AI-enabled disease diagnosis, one that amplifies the collective expertise of radiologists and pathologists, empowers them to work with greater precision and efficiency, and provides better integration across the healthcare continuum all with the aim of providing better care for patients.